Uh, I've been on Connor's show a few times, uh, and it's great. I absolutely love it. He is a very knowledgeable and passionate sports fan, um, and it's infectious. It's hard not to be positive and excited when you go on Connor's show. I, I felt grateful to be there. You know, I, I mean, I love the fact he's doing it. He, he, he's really knowledgeable. You know, he knows what he's talking about. Um, a couple times I've actually been jealous, you know, like, I mean, he's getting Justin Jefferson on his show and Lou Nanny and all the, and the coaches, and I'm not getting these guys on my TV show, and Connor's getting them on his, and it's great. Um, I think the way Connor treats everybody, you know, uh, as an equal, makes it really, really appealing to listen to. Well, I, I, it's true. I mean, he, you know, he's, uh, he's an inspiration, and I'm not sure he set out to be an inspiration. I think he's just being himself. And the beauty of him being himself is it shows other people that regardless of what your ability level is, use it and do great things and charge forward. And he does all those things, right? And the end result is this really fun, interesting radio program that he puts on. Um, and I think it just has a lot to do with the authenticity of who Connor is. That's what, that's what makes the show to me. So I met Connor uh, through St. Thomas Academy because Connor's uh, brothers and my kids played football together. And the greatest thing about Connor is, you know, I love amateur athletics and I love football. And Connor loves it just as much. But the great thing is, is that when I started, other than just having a guy that would cheer as loud as me, when I started talking to Connor, I realized this guy's really knowledgeable. And then I realized this guy's actually more knowledgeable than me when it comes to some things in sports. So we'll dive deep into stuff about, you know, how the line's playing and why the linebackers aren't shifting and what we should be running. And Connor has great passion about it and great knowledge. So I love hanging out with him um, at these live sporting events. And I would see him every Friday, you know, for several years while uh, his, his family and my family were intermingling on the football field. It was awesome. But, you know, the thing that was interesting about Connor for me is that uh, I realized when we were talking more, um, I need to know a lot about the news business, but it's hard for me to keep up with the wild and who's making a trade and what the wolves are doing. He knows all this stuff. So he turned out not just to be a friend, but actually a resource like Connor. What do you think about this? Why aren't the wild doing well? Should they move this guy? Should they move this goalie? And he had thoughts and opinions on all of it, and they were interesting. So I was like, not only do I have a new friend to hang out with, I've got someone I can actually use and learn some things from. I, I love his, you know, infectious, positive enthusiasm. It's just great. I mean, every time I'm around him, I think anyone, anyone's around him, you feel uplifted. Um, he's so fun to be around. He's interesting. He's smart. And it's so great that he has this platform to share that with other people. Um, not only so we can learn and be better people, but so he can inspire other folks that are, are dealing with things like Connor is. Um, guy's truly an inspiration.